may be wondering why I'm watering a unicorn, but I think these inflatable pools, these small pools, is really the solution to help you as a parent that maybe you don't have access to a pool very easily. You need to have access to a small body of water. A bathtub is great, but you know, what if you want to practice outside and where it's a lot more fun? You can actually have your kid pick out one of these inflatable pools and be part of it and use their imagination to get something that they're really interested in and that will help them to be more excited about doing things that make them uncomfortable like getting their heads wet or getting their, their hair wet sometimes and in some cases just a little bit of a, a spray like that will be enough to incite anxiety and fear in a lot of kids. So you have to find a way to make this kind of stuff fun. What if you could get a sprayer like this and, and just mist them? You know, this is, this is actually a great fun way to play with water, right? Or, you know, if you were to do, you know, even a, a bigger, stronger stream, they're going to think that this is the most hilarious thing and most fun thing in the world. So if you can get a sprayer and, and make it rain on them, and then get a pool that they get to actually pick out, you might find that your scared kid is now becoming very engaged in what you're doing. What if that is the difference between your student, your child being scared to death of just getting a little bit of water on their face to having fun with it? Wouldn't that be great? So get yourself a unicorn today. Hello, cute kids. And now we're, we're out at the pool. This, it's time to, to get into the water and, and practice our safety skills. This is my, my friend, Bella. So whenever we come to the side of the pool, we wanna wait for our moms and dads. Don't just go running off the side of the pool. That's not safe. You need to wait for your mom and dad. Right, Bella? Yeah, so whenever you come to the side of the pool, you wanna make sure that you sit down first. That's the first thing you do. You don't just go into a pool. You wait for your mom and dad, and then you sit down. Right, there you go, Belva. That's it. And then we say, one, two, three. But I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna take my little Belle Belle in the water. I'm gonna let her go. One, two, three. There we go. Good job. All right, so remember, when you come to the pool, you don't just go running into the pool. You gotta sit down first and wait for your mom and dad. It's one, two, three before you go into the pool, all right? Hello, Uni the Unicorn. How are you today? So, remember, the first thing you have to do when you get to the side of the pool is what, Uni the Unicorn? That's right, sit down and wait for three. We say one, two, three. How can you not say that, Uni the Unicorn? One, two, three. And that's only when your mom and dad says it, not when you say it, when your mom and dad says it. Say together, say one, two, three. Then we can get into the pool, right? Uni the Unicorn. So what we're going to practice now is how we can get better about allowing water to go on our face and not let it bother us, not let it worry us. There's a magic trick you can do. When you get water on your face, you can rub your face and, and all of that will go away. All that yuck, all that worry will go away. All you gotta do is, when you pour water on your head, is wipe your face just like that. I'll show you with you and the unicorn. All right, you and the unicorn. You're full of water, Uni the Unicorn. I think you're a pool. We got a, a little pool right here with Uni the Unicorn. Isn't that great? I say, one, two, wait for three, Uni the Unicorn. One, two, three. It, okay, then we just wipe through Uni's face and all that yuck goes away. Ready? One, two, oh, wait for three. Okay, say one, Two, Uni the Unicorn. No, wait for three. Say one, two, three. Good job, Uni the Unicorn. That's great. Now I gotta do it to myself. It's only fair if I pour it myself. Ready? 
Oh, look at the unicorn. I got some water. Say, one, two, three. Just like that. That's great. Are you laughing? That meme. You need the unicorn. That's great. One, two, three. Oh, there we go. Oh, my belly. And then, mom and dad. This is kind of hard. You need the unicorn. I'm floating away. One, two, three. <laughs> You have to get the water on your face when you're on your belly for that all that worry to go away. It's so important. You can do this in the bathtub or you can do this inside of a unicorn. One, two, three. One, two, three. <laughs> oh, this is so much fun, you know, unicorn. Let's go for a swim. So if you're lucky enough, if you're lucky enough to have a pool, especially a pool with an island like this, this is great. I can't believe this. This is so cool. You can actually go on your bellies right here, just like you could in a bathtub. This is even better. And then get some help in one, two, three. One, two, three. This is great, so I can play right on my belly. I can get used to how the water holds me. This is great. And then I can even sing to the fishes. If you sing in the fishes means you keep your mouth closed and you blow air out of your nose. Mm. <laughs> or you can hum. Mm. Like a uni the unicorn. And you catch a cloud. And sing to the fishes. Or sing like a unicorn. Unicorn. What does a unicorn sound like? What does a unicorn say? <laughs> All right. Well, today was a lot of fun. We ran and we jumped and and we zigged and zagged and we threw balls and and we even got in the water and we and we learned about how we can be safe and make sure we always wait to go into the water for our moms and dads for three one two three we learned how to put our our get our water all over our face we learned how to be have fun with getting water on our face and we say one two three and we pour water on our face and then we can wipe away the yuck so it just goes away just like that and then we can lay on our bellies in the pool and we can get used to how the water holds us it's so much fun well thank you for joining us today with Q kids and i can't wait to see you next time <laughs>